they want, wherever they want with uh, no repercussions. And like you said, it's a, a global issue, whether it's currency, whether it's the police state, whether it's GMOs in the food. And I know many of those things are incorporated into your art in some level and also a little bit of pop culture. I saw the, the Charlie Sheen and all that in there. So, you know, you draw people in and that's a great way to do it. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Great. So what's next for you? Do you have any other uh, upcoming projects? Uh, well, um, I, I mean, apart from um, uh, DeviantArt stuff that I have. Um, Just any. Uh, what's, your, what's your art about? You, where else can we find it? Well, uh, uh, well, I um, I can send you more stuff about it on the email. I, you know, I I'm I'm not prepared to tell you about that right now. Okay, Just, so you got know, some like, some things you want to keep on the on the back burner right now. Going on. Right, right. <laughs> okay, that's all right. That's all right because you know we do that too. You know, we got stuff we don't we don't want people to know about until it's done and it's ready. It's it's ready to ship <laughs> out. So I I definitely understand that. Definitely respect that. So mainly we can find your stuff at DeviantArt. Definitely. Maybe I got a uh, Jakari Jackson versus um, Cyborg Hitler going on. You, who knows? <laughs> well, you can put Jakari Jackson versus APD. That'd probably be more <laughs> more accurate. But yeah, yeah I mean, we love your stuff. We love your style. And, uh, you know, I want you to give an inspirational word just because uh, you were inspired by real events and you took something that you were familiar with and you brought that to other people who can understand it. Give somebody an encouraging word, whether that thing is art, whether it's music, uh, poetry, whatever video editing, give somebody an encouraging word so they can take their skills and what they have and educate other people. Well, I think um, everybody can do um, something about it. I mean, um, you know, I mean, it doesn't have to be a lot. Uh, you know, you can spend a little bit of time um, each day just to put something onto it. it you know, I mean, it, I don't know. I mean, it, I, when I do this stuff, I don't think about like it, it has to be something in return. It doesn't have to be like people has to like it. I'm just doing it because I'm passionate about it. I'm, I'm having a lot of fun. So, um, you know, and it, you know, and the rest is, doesn't really matter. So, you know, as long as I um, get the message out, it, you know, it's, it's all good. So, um, you know, if, I mean, if you, if you feel good about it, then it's, you know, it's, <laughs> if you if you like what you do, other people will like it too. Because when you're passionate about your stuff, as you obviously are, other people can see this. You know, I you know I just met you right now talking to you via Skype, but I could look at this image, you know, of Alex and President Obama. I say, man, this guy takes his stuff seriously. He loves what he does, and he's passionate about his work. And you know, even if you do it just you know, initially for yourself, there are other people that can be encouraged, and they say, you know, what's up with this Alex Jones guy? What's up with David Ike? What's up with uh, Mitt Romney or whoever else there are? in these pictures and they can go and research these things for themselves and find out what's really going on in the world. Well, Pizarro, I, I definitely thank you for your time and uh, give us your finishing thoughts. Well, thank you for having me. All right, uh, Pizarro at DeviantArt.com. Thank you, sir. And if you'd like to see more artists, more anti-NWO artists, you can go to the InfoWars shop and pick up a copy of the InfoWars magazine. You can buy them in bulk, you can get them singles, whatever you need to do to spread this message of liberty. Each month we feature a different artist. Well, that's it for this edition of the InfoWars Nightly News, and we'll see you again next time. The facts are in. The studies are legion. Sodium fluoride and other toxic members of the fluoride family are devastating the health and cognitive ability of the American people. So why are the social engineers adding it to the water? Simple. Dumb down the host population that the parasitic technocracy is feeding on. We may not have been able to get fluoride out of the water supply yet, but we can help to get it out of our bodies. I am extremely excited to announce the exclusive InfoWars Life Fluoride Shield Formulation fusing six of the best documented ingredients from around the world to help the body remove not just toxic fluoride residues from the body, but a whole host of toxic substances. Let's take a stand against the globalist by blocking their poisons with fluoride shield. I use fluoride shield every day. Secure your fluoride shield and other pioneering formulations at InfoWarsLife.com today. Let's start cleansing our bodies now and support the InfoWar at the same time. That's InfoWarsLife.com. You are watching the InfoWars Nightly News, which airs 7 p.m. Central at InfoWarsNews.com. Members can share their passcodes with up to 11 other people, and your support is helping us defend liberty worldwide.